Hey guys, it's Habs, and in today's video, we take on weekly pack number 76. And today, we're just going to be copy-pasting Scorpions. This team is the most lethal team that I have ever created because we just deliver Scorpion after Scorpion after Scorpion onto the opposing team, thanks to what is supposed to be a nerfed Pteranodon. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this one. If you do, maybe like and subscribe. But with all of that said, let's jump in. You know what? We could do this. Good amount of HP on the duck. We need one more for the triple. We have a triple here already. As long as there's no moth. No moth. So we weaken you. We take a few hits here. I think we might have enough for the draw again. <laughs> Two draws back to back. Okay. This is where it really starts to count though. We get the level up into... Hmm. I mean, I'll take a sheep, sure. Roll. Peacock is kind of nice. Peacock with the goose is actually a really nice setup. We could increase our attack and reduce our health. I don't think I want to do that. I'm going to roll. There's a duck. There's a peacock. We'll hold the pill. There's another peacock. No way. Okay, so next time... I mean, do we save? I think we save. I think we'll save the level ups for turn 5. Which means we're going to probably throw a couple rounds here. Okay, that was a sneaky little... Oh, onto you. That's a shame. It's a shame we got the ant buff onto uh, onto the wrong pet there. But it's it's okay. We're going to do this. Could go anywhere. Doesn't really matter too much. That's actually the perfect placement. Um, we'll bring in the peacock here. I'm going to hold this. That's a level up. This is a level up. And we're just going to roll. We're not going to go peacock three. Yeah, we're not going to go peacock three. We're not going any of these three. Um, I'm basically rolling for sloth there. <laughs> I'm rolling for sloth because I'm not picking up anything. Nothing there is actually going to entice me to take it. Okay, we actually survived the hit there. Do we have enough? We have enough for the draw. Draw is fine. I can't believe we haven't got a trophy yet. Okay, level into you and you. Oh, I mean... Clownfish, really nice. And Penguin, really nice as well. Let's sell and bring Clownfish and Penguin in. I mean, also Turtle, really nice too. But we're going to do this. Uh, these two are actually going to scale because of the Penguin. You know what? It almost feels like we should bring the Peacock in for now. Because there's nothing else that we're going to be looking for. And we'll run it like this. Sheep at the back for now. Okay, so this peacock's going to get stronger. The only thing we're a bit concerned about is just moths. Because the moment we're triggering before the moth. Okay, this is a pretty good turn for us. Dirty rats, go. Take down you. Nice. Okay, we get our first trophy. We're on the board. We're on the board. Jellyfish. Ah, oh, jellyfish, clownfish would be good. But it's too late for that. It's just too late. We're on turn six. Turn 6 jellyfish just does not work with us. Double pill. Roll it. Nothing. Roll. We'll bring this in for a potential level up. And I guess garlicking you is not a bad shout either. Now I've got a couple of builds that I want to try out. Um, none of which involve any of these pets. So <laughs> we're a long way off of what we could be doing. But um, we'll just see how it plays out. You don't want to pre-plan pre things too much. That was a bit of a mouthful. We don't want to pre-plan things too much. Otherwise, I mean, we'll start searching for it in the shop and we'll never find it. Although the manta ray is something. The manta ray is certainly something. Let's bring you in. I don't think we're going to go for that, though. We'll roll. We're not going to level you. Nothing here. And we go again. I guess we can take this. Goose and Peacock at the moment are just going to carry us. Ooh, okay. Nyala's a nice pickup for them. And we take down the jellyfish. And we still survive on that as well. Don't think we have enough for the Nyala. Yeah, see that? That golden doggo can really turn the tides. This is a nice level up. But I'm going to wait for turn 9 for that. Um, I don't think I want to bring in these. I think I'm just going to roll. We look for clownfish. Put this on you. Uh, the penguin's going to go. The penguin will go. 
So next time we'll level the sheep. Oh, we should be able to do this one. We're going to have enough attack to take maybe even one shot. Yeah, we're one shotting. That is three for three. We're still in it. We are still in it. Okay, give me something good. Ooh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Let's do this. And we could go for... I think we just go for the stats. I think I'm just going to go for the... I think we just go for the stats. Let's roll. Nyala is actually really nice. Um, Lemon is just an upgrade for now. Do we bring Nyala in? I guess we could sell you and do this. And run it something like this. Again, this is just not the build that I'm going for. But we'll take it for now. Maybe we can pivot into the build later on. It really does depend on what sort of build other people go as to whether some of the things I have in mind are actually going to work. But that is four. Okay, we're going to roll it. There's a level up and we get, what do we get off of this? Okay, lioness. We could bring the lioness in actually. Um, penguin goes, we'll bring the lioness in. Let's roll. That's a level up as well. And you know what? I don't think I'm going to take either of these. I think we just run it like this. We use the Lioness for some scaling. Maybe we bring in a second Lioness. Maybe we do some Lioness scaling. We just try and live off of the... Live off our Peacock. See if the Peacock can carry us for now. A little bit of Lioness scaling. And then just maybe we might be able to get something done at the end. That takes us to five. Okay, some stats. Pretty good. Let's roll. Nothing for us here. I mean, this is good gold because we've got the three. But I'm looking for the lioness. I kind of want to bring in the pteranodon. You know what? I think maybe. Seems kind of crazy, but I'm going to bring in you. Roll. Ooh, <laughs> I mean, triple slug. Not the route that we're going to take, though. Uh, let's just do this so that you, you don't get taken out. Okay. Oh, we survived this hit just. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> I mean, this peacock's doing nothing. <laughs> that peacock is going to do nothing for us. Um, okay, let's roll. We don't need you. I, th I, I mean, we're just going to roll it here. We need more lioness would be nice. If we can find some. Where is the lioness when you need it? We'll hold the chocolate. Roll and then... One more roll. A little bit of a buffer. Okay, we go again. Currently, we've got six wins. The peacock's going to slowly get caught up on by the rest. I mean, so... That's a 16. is a 32. Okay, we definitely lose this one. I don't think we can take that. It's a 40. I just don't think we've got enough. No, it's close, though. It was close, but we just did not have enough. Okay. We take the level up, and we get another lioness, which we'll bring in. Roll. Okay, now we start to pivot. Now it's the pivot time. Roll it. Roll again. I think I'm just going to roll here. Okay, double lioness now. Some double lioness scaling, and we're going to run. So the idea is we're just going to run pteranodon and scorpions. That's the plan. <laughs> But the problem is we probably need to get um, a couple of scorpions and pteranodons going for it to work. Oh, and we're down to one. We're down to one. Okay. So let's do this. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Why did that happen? Why did that happen? Let's bring you in. Hold this. Roll. Hold you and roll. Okay. Okay. So we're going to do scorpion followed by scorpion. And I'm hoping... Okay, now we take you down. You survive the hit, which is good. Then we've got the scorpion, then we've got the scorpion, then we get you, and it's a draw. That's fine. Okay, we're still in the game. We are still in the game. Let's bring you in. Let me keep this scorpion down here. I'm just going to keep rolling. There's another one. And we're going to do this. Okay. 
We're so close. So close to just having scorpions that are 20. Just in case they have melon from the turtle. Okay, that's actually pretty nice that we survived that hit. That takes us to seven. The build is coming together. It is coming together. Uh, I mean, I think, you know what? I think we just do this. Bring you in. And we'll roll it. And we do that, which is really nice. And we're going to do this. That gets the level up. We could do this just to get the extra stats at the back as well. I think maybe maybe in this order. Okay, so we've got Pteranodon and three scorpions. <laughs> and we've got another one being baked in the in the uh in the shot right now. It's just this is just scary. <laughs> it's just scary. The scorpions and pteranodons are just it's just a scorpion factory. That's all this is. It is just a scorpion factory. Um I mean, we'll just keep rolling here. Do we just bring... I guess we could bring this in for now. I do kind of want to find another scorpion. So I'm just going to roll it. Maybe we do find it. We get this. That's the level up. But I think by the time we get it, we're probably going to be bringing these in. So I think we sell this next time. We bring in the scorpion. And then anything else, any other scorpions, we can, we can just bring in. Okay, we might lose this one. Although the Scorpion Factory might be enough. One, two, three. Do we have enough on this Lioness to get it done? We do. That takes us to nine. No way is this actually working. Um, we could level you up, but you're gone. And we're bringing this in. And now we're just looking for Scorpions to just give extra stats to these. Like, that can go onto you. And if we can find one more, would be really nice. Okay, we don't find another one. That's okay. I mean, we'll just roll it. There's another one for next time. I think maybe we just try and send the weakest first. And we go like this. Okay, it's all about the scorpions. Can we get it done? Okay, scorp on scorp. And these have got over, so we're going to go straight through the melon. No way. This is actually gone and worked. <laughs> and there we have it. There we have it, the Scorpion Factory. I mean, this this build was kind of wild. I, I I had this in my head, but I didn't really think that we could get it done. And this was actually my first attempt. Kind of crazy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this Scorpion Factory run. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.